All right, it's Dave back. Having a little bit of technical difficulties, but see if we can't get you something. I had planned on doing a video today of picking garlic. Well, as you can see, here it all is. And the technical difficulty is, for some reason, my phone is refusing to record more than a minute or two at a time. If you have a solution, by all means, please leave it in the comments. I have adjusted the resolution. I have made sure the battery was uh, of acceptable strength. I have checked the data. I even deleted some things off. Plenty of data, plenty of things. Uh, I, the only thing that I can think of is I just have a software update as of June 30th, and I'm not sure if that's what's causing it or not. So in any event, uh, I have 3 minutes and 11 seconds to do this video, and as of now, I've just uh, told you all about what's going on in a minute and 5 seconds. So, here we go. Plant our garlic uh, at Halloween, or very close to it, because, you know, vampires and all, we keep it weeded, we keep it mulched um, as best possible, which really is not a difficult issue until just this time of year when when spring breaks and summer gets hot that's when the seems to be that you suddenly have the issues with uh weeds and things have uh four kinds of garlic this is a Killarney red uh, uh a um hard hard garlic this is a uh, spanish uh rojo which uh is a very good garlic uh, a very good uh culinary garlic then we have Transylvania here, and the last one is Sicilian or Sicily. Uh, these are soft neck garlics, so we'll be uh, braiding those in a little bit. Um, the Sicilian is a uh, very uh, short shelf life, as well as the Spanish Roja here. I grow my garlic generally for the amount that I can grow in the space I have, so therefore I don't uh, grow for huge bulbs. In addition, this year, I let a number of my garlic scapes, see that? That's the garlic scape when you actually let it go, and it produces all sorts of little tiny garlic, they call them bulbals, and those can be planted, and they take several years to grow, so I, I saved some of them, did not cut them off, gonna plant them, see how they do. I'm gonna come back to you later with a um, taste test on these, each one, um, I've read about what they taste like, but I want to find out for myself. And then there you have it. Uh, probably once they're dry, I won't weigh them until they're dry. Once they're dry, we're probably talking at least 10 or, 15, 10 or 12, 15 pounds of garlic. And I am almost out of time. I got six seconds. Stay safe. Stay prepared. And I will see you on the next.